Here it is, the first one, guys, that I missed last episode. Got the heart piece. I almost said container, but it's a piece. A piece of heart. Booyah. So yeah, I just need to keep an eye on Link's health and keep him alive while I go around looking for this heart container that's hidden here. The hidden heart container. Really? Found it, guys. I am an idiot. I think what happened was, I think what happened was that I'd left this like for my guys to finish off the keep boss and they did and I w just wasn't there to see the cutscene. But I might be mistaken, I might be a complete fool. And Sia's other breast, fantastic. Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Hyrule Warriors Adventure Map. So in the last episode, we went into here and I didn't get everything, and then we went into here and I did get everything. So, you know, a bonus is, is... Now we're going in here as Agatha again, and I just got a new weapon for her. It's recommended that I use fire, but I'm using Agatha since that's why I get the a rank bonus for. I also get a flute. I don't care. I don't care. Actually, we'll take this chance to go into the bazaar and by this Let's see fire right there now I take less damage when I'm doing this and yeah let's do this jump into here with my new Luna parasol I need to get 2,000 kills to unlock its skill but it has a light bonus and rupees and has more base damage all right defeat all the enemies advance to the destination Play this up before I even walk in. Ow, that must have hurt. I used to make Poe dead, though. Come on. Use an ability. Fine. I never do that attack. Okay, at the moment I start doing my stuff. I just want to be a jerk about this. I can be a jerk too and send bugs after you. Advance to the next keep. Yeah, this is going to be a really simple one. They always are. Until you get to the boss enemies, and then those are either really simple or incredibly annoying to deal with. Either or. I'm going to take this time to head over here though and collect this. Uh, I don't really care about more grass. Unless there's some just... Yeah, okay. If it's on the way, I'll grab it because it fills up my SP. Alright. Now that I got both of those... Butterfly! Beetle and butterfly. Beetlefly, if uh, you may. If I may. You're just gonna. You're just gonna keep dodging forever? And butterfly! Beetle and butterfly? You did not get deaded because the wall. How did you even. Ghosts! Ghosts, how do they work? They don't, that's why. They're all hobos. Every single one of them. I don't even know what I'm on about. Alright. Let's head out this way. I don't think there's anything hidden on this one, so I don't have to worry. 
I'm gonna be sure though. Check sculpt. No sculpt was, and I'm pretty sure there were no uh, things either. Again, hit two of you actually. Come on, use one of your abilities. Hit two of you with that as well. I dare you to attack me. Oh, I think you were supposed to be some kind of master knight. And yes. Finished. Mission successful. That took all of four minutes to do. And that means we're probably gonna have a three thing episode unless this next one is incredibly long. And if it is, I'll probably cut it down just so we can have a three thing episode. Because, you know, I like getting through these a bit faster. I have a next project I really want to get to. And I also have some side projects that I'm going to be starting up with in the next few weeks. That I've been saying I'm going to start up. But I kept getting sick. But I finally have the first few episodes of one of them edited. And the other one I'm trying to edit, but I'm having some weird issues getting it off of my stream thing. Because it's a stream thing I did. Um, it kind of sucks. I need to figure that out. Oh, well. <laughs> Shut up. You, 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 that's all you do. You go, ah. <laughs> Shut up. Also, that kind of bothers me that I can make that noise so well. <laughs> um. Huh. Okay, get rid of that. I don't really care about this one either. I just got a bunch of money from that. So that's fine. That's just fine. It's perfectly fine. It's great even. Alright. I could go up and play Link, but I'm going to go right and play anyone I want, which is probably going to be Link all the same. Defeat 600 enemies in 10 minutes. Recommended water, though. Fine, I'll use a water one since you won't let me use Link. Mm, I could play Rudo. I honestly don't like Rudo. <laughs> I I feel bad because she's not that bad, but honestly, I just don't like Rudo. So I think I'll play Lana in her spear because honestly, she's decent. 210 for materials, rupees, and other thing. Um, I could use this time to, you know, try to get some of these skill skills grinded a little bit, but I'm not going to, since I'll do that on my time, not yours. Okay, so guys, uh, yeah, once again, I'm using skins for some characters. For all the characters I can, I'm using a skin that I prefer for them. Uh, if they don't, if they have extra skins and I'm not using them, it's because I don't like their skins. Sorry for anyone who likes those skins, but you know, it's my playing, not yours. And I will say, this is actually a skin I kind of like. It's interesting for Alana. Um, like, some of the classic like oh hey yeah these are like 
Impa from Ocarina of Time and stuff. I'm just like, yeah, but I didn't like Impa from Ocarina of Time. She was kind of disturbing. She, she, I, I, oh my gosh. Um, I'm gonna do something weird for a Let's Player and actually link a freaking, uh, uh, a bridge series right now. This is, I think his name is Dana on YouTube, and he did an Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask bridge. It's decently funny. Uh, I enjoyed it while watching it. I don't think he's still doing it, but you know, it's there, and I figure if I enjoy some stuff, I'm gonna promote it. I hope he doesn't mind that. I've never even spoken to the man. I think I actually commented on something he replied to or something, but that's the extent of me talking to him. Alright, let's summon a giant tree that I'm going to hop up on the side of. I want to do machine gun fire. Amanda, would you use attack that requires... There we go. That did not actually work. Amanda, I need you to head this way a little bit. Thank you. Okay. That is BS you know it. Midnight, fine. I'm not even fighting you then. If you're just gonna waste my time by hiding behind a stupid giant boss. I hate it. I hate it because the AI knows. It just goes... It just goes, oh, I see that you're doing a thing. Machine gun fire. Machine gun executions are the most fun. See Agatha? I mean, that'd be ironic considering the fact that I'm playing her so much recently. Um, hey, Manhandler. I see that you're over here, so I'm gonna run past you and go kill Minda. Hey, Minda! Midna! Hey! You're a jerk. There we go. Defeated Minda. Now I'm gonna fight Agatha, actually. Alright, run... Actually, there's a way down here. I was about to say, oh, there's no way down here, and I'm like, wait, yeah, there is. Transport captain, I could really use your help right now. And by help, I mean for you to die. Alright. Um... Just a second, guys. Alright, I'm back, and, uh, well, the, the dog needed out. She was like, ah, oh, rough, 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 I'm, uh, I'm gonna need to the restroom. And I'm like, ugh, oh, wow. Restroom, yeah. Dogs, do you have restrooms? Mm -hmm. Yard? That's clean. Did you get an execution? Alright, I only... I have 300 more that I need to kill. I wasted so much time on Midna. Alright, let's see. Agatha's inspired troops? Oh no. Um... So this is a problem right here. When I start spreading them out, I haven't killed enough in some places to spawn new ones. This is the issue. Alright. Uh, let's head down here to see if there are a good amount of enemies. Perfect! Let's summon a giant tree. Hey, me. In a different outfit. I will say, though, after finding out there are outfits in this game, I was extremely happy. I was like, oh, there, I can make my characters look different. Better even. Oh my. And I was the happiest camper I've ever been. Alright, so I'm running low on time. I have 85 enemies to kill in the next two minutes. Ah, uh, this sucks. Should have played as someone else. Until I realized I can do this. The problem is that I didn't get an A rank. Oh well. I mean, it's not necessary. Oh, 
Wait, did I do it? There were enemies around me? Okay. Well, I did it, guys. With like two minutes left. Whew, looks like we won somehow. Somehow. Yeah. I definitely think she looks better in that outfit. She looks less like a K-pop idol and more like a, you know, guardian of time. Yeah, clear time was not good. Oh well. I, it didn't require me to get A rank for anything, so it doesn't matter. I still got this card. And now guys, let's do it. Let's finally get Zant. Since we just got the digging mitts, let's use them. Break into this castle through the back door, just like in Link to the Past. Alright. We're doing it this episode, no other choices. Defeat the shadow. Defeat the shadow. Just a second. No, it couldn't be the last one, right? It's a shadow beast. This isn't the ruler of... This might be the last thing we have to do. We'll see, guys. Um, Agatha, you're our weapon year. Weapon year? I don't know. Let's see materials, but rubies on this one. I'm gonna do this one. <laughs> All right, let's do this. You know, now that I think about it, her parasol kind of reminds me of Peach. I know it's just because it's a parasol and, you know, Peach is known for that, but it just kind of reminds me of Peach. Weird as it may be. I mean, they both use weird weapons, like Peach can use Toad or even freaking, uh, uh, what was it, frying pans and things like that. Turnips, even when she wants to. All right, Dinophos, take the hit. Wow. All right, uh, I need to head down here. This guy's in this no, like keep over here. He's like, I'm gonna take over the keep. And I'm like, no, you're not gonna take over my keep. It's my keep. Why was that sounding slightly Italian, even though it didn't sound at all Italian? It just had the keep thing. I don't know. I'm, uh, I'm incredibly bad with accents, and I always try to do them, like, accidentally. Fire, why are you helping them? There's a shadow beast here. You should be slaying it. Alright, that did not hit her weak point, sadly. Come on, get dizzy. Get dizzy. Touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Hit by both of those, not enough damage. All right, there we go. Deaded. Bye bye. 
Mission successful. You ordered out the enemy commander. Just a second, I need to check. Are there any skull to us? Yes, there are for kill 1000 and 1200, which means that they're probably heart pieces and containers. Wait, what? Wait, wait, wait. Zant, Midna. Yeah, the hell. How did you get in here? And Dinolfo's dead? No, not quite. Feed of the Dinolfos. Luckily, I don't have to worry about getting, uh... Oh, I was just reading, sorry. Uh, luckily I don't have to even worry about getting the second thing, the second, uh, Gold Skull Claw, because, you know, it's impossible. They were nice enough to make it impossible, so you don't have to worry about it the first time you play it. Dead hit. Alright. Now that those forces are dead, we need to take the center keep. If this is really the finale, then this is kind of not as hard as I thought it was going to be. Then again, it is with a new character who I just leveled up and made sure she was powerful enough to take down everything else around her. So, oh, Impa, Impa, wait, wait, you're fighting Zant. <laughs> Let me help even the odds here a little bit. Sure, sure, Zan, whatever you say. All right, take the butterflies. Beat the Zant without even the use of the butterfly beetle combo. Dude, I just beat your leader. You don't really stand a chance here. Okay, now I need to head up there. I need to get into that keep and take the gold skull to Everything's going really freaking well, actually. Except that Impa is. Uh, she's at above half health. She's not. I don't even have to worry about her. That keep is about to fall, so I'll have to get back to the Allied base soon to help take that. I kind of wish they would actually make this a trap and make this lock me in. That would be freaking cool. If they did that kind of thing more often. Impa, you're still at above half health. Come on. Keep boss is dead. You know what, since I'm not coming back here, I might as well take this, right? Alright, need to get to Impa to heal her up because she's once again at half health. Actually, she can't even be healed at half. She has to be below 25%, I think. 
So that's not really something I have to worry about. But I have to get to the northern keep. I also have to get to the southeast keep. And you get to the northeast and southeast keep. That way I can take both of them. Or I guess help the northeast. Southeast, I need that uh, freaking fairy, though. Oh, yeah, this wasn't even that bad. Still at above half health. What are you guys even complaining about? The only keep that matters about being at below three quarters health is the main keep, the alley base. That one cannot get low, or else anyone can walk in and just start smashing it, and there's no coming back from that. I will say that Agatha's techniques, they're kind of slow at the start, I will, met, I will admit, but honestly, I kind of like them because they hit such a high area that it makes it worth it because they hit everything within the area, unlike Wizros where, oh, it'll be blotched out whether you're going to be hit or not because it shoots little balls that will quite often miss. With her, no, it's giant bugs and wind attacks that will for sure hit most everything. You know the area that's going to hit, so you can prepare for it. Alright, gotcha. Southeast time, so I can uh, get the ferry. Nothing I really need to take the keep because, you know, it's not like, well, oh, you need a fairy to get a fairy to get a fairy to unlock this area. That'd be kind of interesting. Though. I can't wait to see what they're going to do in the other adventure modes because I am going to play those at some point. It'll be a break between because, you know, too much of this would drive anyone insane and make me the least interesting person. Um... But yeah, I cannot wait to try those out later on and see how they do them because I've heard some interesting things about how they do it. Added a lot of new challenges and like different variants depending on like whether you're playing the Twilight map, the Master Quest map, etc, etc. You rescued the Fairy of Light. Thanks to that, you can use its power to break open this giant white barrier by sacrificing its soul. I mean, what? So, now that I've done that... Boom. Take this! Because I can. Alright. Now, I think I'm gonna head to the Eastern Keep, the Mid-Eastern Keep, and uh, take that using this Light Fairy. I kinda wish I knew if like, if I remembered that I remember, I don't even know what I was trying to say there. I kind of wish that I remembered if there were heart pieces or not. Because I feel like there's going to be, but I haven't seen any yet. So, you know. Boom. Now that I've killed so many enemies and taken so little damage thanks to the fact that that's what it's like. Oh, and there are heart pieces. <laughs> uh, that's what it's like. It's like with Midna. She has attacks that she doesn't actually have to be in the attack for. Like her spinning like, disc dog thing. She isn't actually in there. And yet she can still fight and everything. Also, that was a boss key. I'm wrong. There are none. Uh, prove me wrong, game. See how it is. But no, uh, I think that's what I like about it. I like how Minna has a wide variety of attacks that she just decimates everything in the area for, and you don't even have to worry about getting hit for. And that's what this is like. She flies up in the air, and she's on a butterfly's back. What's going to hit her up there besides someone's special attack or something? Like that? Which, to be fair, it would, those can pretty much hit you anywhere. Except for when I eat them. Because when I use them, they're like, oh, yeah, you're not going to be able to hit anything. You're just going to be bouncing here. Bye. 
or am I wrong? And there is a heart container or a piece. Game, this is an emotional roller coaster. It's not cool. Stop it. It's a heart piece. Okay, fine game. See how it is. I see how it is. All right, I'm gonna head to the one directly east of it. Because honestly, freaking, there's a chance there's a heart container in there. And if there is, then I want it. Because I want to collect everything. I gotta get them all. Gotta get them all. I gotta get them all. Gotta get them all. Oh, we all live in this completionist world. Completionist? I don't know. I was trying to think of something catchy, but that was the least catchy thing I've ever come up with. Actually, no, I've come up with worse. Trust me, you don't want to hear the ones I've come up with. I've actually probably suppressed those already. They're just really sketchy things you can never remember. And heart container. Thank you, baby, darling. Turns out it's not, and it's actually just a hidden item. Another freaking boss key. That'd be hilarious to me. I'd just sit there, I'd just stare at them, I'm like, really? You really did that to me? Alright, since those enemies up there, those raid captains or whatever they are, can't even take down that uh, outpost captain over there, I can just walk straight into their base without any fear of anything bad happening. Hey, Minda. Hey, Minda! Hi! How are you? You doing good? I'm doing good! Take this! I'm throwing a fit! I win. King Dodongo? That's the beast? So this is the attack that happens when you don't use the X attack. Wait, really? Okay, I'm gonna kill the Rally Captain. I'm gonna murder that Rally Captain and then I'm gonna kill the Dodongo. Yeah, I get it already. Rally Captain is inspiring everyone. Yeah, cool. There we go. Boom. Almost dead. Dead. And I win. GG. No re. Honestly, that's actually a kind of good idea now that I think about it. Rally captains makes it so that, you know, it's much harder to beat them. That would actually be a really good idea if they did that more often. Like, actually having multiple rally captains, they're all strengthening, so you have to take those guys out, but you also have to worry about the super boss or captains or uh, whatever they are trying to ruin everything while you're doing it. So you either have to be quick or you have to be strong enough to take the captain. Okay, uh, I forgot though, this is gonna take a while. What? Oh no, I didn't have my bomb selected. I was like, why wasn't it working? Come on, give me another thing. Thank you. How did you get hurt so badly? Is Midna over here? I mean, not Midna, Impa? Because if Impa's over here, that would actually make sense. Impa is a water user and whatnot and can pierce defense. Damage over time and whatnot. Dang it, so close. Sorry, Gorons. At least you're immune to fire. Another. You guys live in lava. Why does that even bother you? That would hurt, though. Ow. That would hurt. 
fully knock you out if you're not careful. Gotcha. Oh, hit you with the beetle. That's gotta hurt. And get a bunch more free attacks on you since you just did that out of nowhere. Alright, about halfway done. Slammed. Come on. Guys, this couldn't be the finale, right? Even if it is the finale, I should show off the rest of the adventure map, shouldn't I? Or should I? I don't know. This can't be the finale because this isn't the Dark Ruler. This is just some Shadow Beast, apparently. I kind of would have found it cool if they'd actually uh, made a Shadow model for this. Like, this is dark in the color. That cannot be the hardest thing to do. on King Kodango once more. Just one more time and I can kill him. Gotcha. With these beautiful butterfly wings, I kill you. And I even got a gold one. I don't need a gold one. Why do I keep getting gold freaking things on him? I need the claws, not the crystals. I need them to upgrade Link. Dang it. All right, skip that since we've seen it so many freaking times already. Did not get an A rank, thanks to the clear time of 20 minutes. I did not feel like that took 20 minutes, but it did. So yeah, this is gonna be a long episode now, guys. Sorry about that. This might even be a 30 minute episode. You can now battle a Zant. Usurper uh, scimitars. Curved blades birth from twilight magic. A gauge fills up with each combo attack you connect. Alright, we got everything but one skull to us, so I'll grab that next time. Uh... I... Let's see. Defeat Warriors of Twilight. Defeat the Shield Moblin Forces. Watch out, all attacks are devastating. I don't know what we're going to do, guys. So next time, let's play Hyrule Warriors Adventure Map. We're going to be going in here somewhere. We could even head all the way east, but I kind of want to take care of this top left corner to make things a bit more, you know, taken care of. So guys, see you then.